let's go let's go let's go welcome back to another one of shay's reactions did you guys miss me because i definitely definitely miss you guys how have everybody been um you could pull up in the comments let me know how y'all been um i definitely will respond but yes shay is back at it so yeah i know i've been mia for a little bit i've been an mia just for a little bit you feel me but liona is still out here bugging She's, yo, I got so much, a couple of things in the trigger, so I'ma just go on and play this video first. Um, I know it's old, but <laughs> I definitely didn't put a touch of my commentary on it, so I'm definitely gonna, um, play the video, and you guys give me y'all thoughts and y'all opinions on this, because shorty crazy, she do, she's delusion, delusional, she's really a Jezebel, like, at its finest, that's her, but let's go, let's go, let's go. <laughs> Let's go on to the video. What y'all see me got on is a two piece set from the boutique. As you can see, it's purple, it's comfy. Little belly out, but if you don't like your belly out, girl, you can run the shirt, but. I like mine's out. It's the back of it. I love. She finally sewing and adding into that boutique. She's finally after how long? I guess her funds must be running low, but we could look at it and tell it's a two piece. But I ain't even gonna talk too much. Let's go. This girl's slow though. Definitely. Soft side of the inside. It got this also in the pants, y'all. In the pants. Okay. But it's a two piece little jogger set. You know what I'm saying? You got pockets right here. You got pockets right here. And it's cute and comfortable. Cute and comfortable. Cute. So this outfit. Ooh, camera got blurry on me. Okay, there we go. Get it right, camera. So this is a dress. Dun, dun, dun. Let me turn the comments to the side. Okay. Girl, I think you should have wrote something down to say to be able to sell your clothes. Cause at this point you just freestyle and saying anything. But if that's how that's how your supporters accept it and take it, that's how they accept it and take it. But trust and believe you would just have a little bit of portion of people that's gonna buy your gear because you don't even know how to I, you don't even know how to describe your stuff. And first of all, yes, that dress is cute. And I'm not hating from afar. That dress is definitely popping. But it's popping for the ones that got BBLs and fake bodies. Because that material, it's not good on natural bodies. So let's get to it. Let's talk since you always think your shit don't stink. Since you think your shit don't stink. That and don't forget to tell the people that material is only for the fake body women. Okay, let's go. <laughs> This is a dress. Turn your comments to the side in case y'all want to see what the outfit look like. Turn your comments to the side so you can, you know, you can see the fit. You can't see the fit because everybody and their mama commenting back to back to back to back. <laughs> but this is a fit. It's a dress. I will pair this with some black thigh highs or pink. Y'all know I'm different. I don't follow the trends. I am the trend, so you know, I'm different. But it's so cute. It got pockets right here. I'm like, why y'all put pockets right there? But you know, us women, we be liking to uh, grab our little boobies anyway. <laughs> but uh, anyways, this is so cute, y'all. Like, get into it. Get into it. No, you're just the only nasty Jezebel that walks in the streets and want to touch her fake boobies. Robert's boobies. But anyways, let's go. <laughs> get into it. Get into it. Get into it. Get into it, get into it. Okay, so it's the back. And no hating, but that dress is definitely cute or whatever for the fake body women. But that heart with the string, why that look like a tampon though? She should have put that patch somewhere else if she made it because you know she always be out here in these streets frauding. Yeah, she's a fraud. So who knows? She probably just took it off a um a, a website or something like that. But um, yeah. She stole that dress from somebody else. She definitely didn't make it, but whoever made it shouldn't put that string on the ass because it definitely looked like a tampon coming out the ass. A tampon coming out the ass. <laughs> I 
yourself what it's supposed to give it also says you're doing great and it also says <laughs> it also says seek inner peace and i felt like it's a lot of people a lot of people who need to seek some inner peace you know what i'm saying y'all out here doing too much you're doing too much see it says you're doing great yes i believe she probably did make this jacket because that's definitely her all the way but she's definitely the opposite she's definitely not seeking no inner peace she's definitely a devil and she is a devil in disguise and using god the most high as a prize that's basically what she's doing she really don't care about god she's coming she's a devil Okay, trying to be in disguise and trying to talk about God. But anyways, it's crazy how you still find a way to still throw shots at Robert. You know, come on, everybody know, like I know, hint, hint, who these things is, who she's throwing these shots at. Okay, first of all, and if you're happy, why, why are you selling your clothes, your brand for your daughter and or whatever like that? That's supposed to be a Morris line and stuff like that. But you're still hitting and throwing shots at her father. What type of business backwards woman are you? Am I wrong, guys? Y'all give me y'all thoughts and y'all opinions. Tell me if I'm wrong because I, I, I take criticism. I take it well and I will fix and apologize if y'all think I'm wrong. But I don't think I'm wrong. That's my opinion. But anyways, like you always throwing shots. Girl, sell them clothes. Sell them clothes. Them cheap ass material clothes. Sell them. Peace. So a lot of people out here need to seek some inner peace. Like you. You know how you don't got no peace? This ain't on the website. These ladies ain't on the website. Just threw it on so y'all can see the jacket. But you know how... And nobody want to buy them freaking 2000, um, 2000s uh, leggings. Them leggings was in the 2000s, popping in the 2000s leggings with the jerseys and stuff. Girl, if you don't get it together and you talking about some New York, you love New York. Girl, if you don't step your game up, I, I guess I see John now, gay now, still haven't stepped your game up because it's still trash. Still trash. But anyways. Oh, that you don't have inner peace when you constantly in drama. When you constantly commenting negatively, when you constantly worried about everybody else's life instead of your own, hint, hint, am I talking to somebody that's looking at me that's real mad? That's your colors. And that's why I definitely, after this video, I'm going to post another video because every time you try to come with positivity or you try to talk about your fake abuse or you want to talk about narcs, I'm going to continue to have my foot on your neck and I'm going to continue to play these videos because and then you got the nerve to be trying to do another interview with the news about abuse and cyberbullying. But I'm going to touch on that another time the next video i'm definitely gonna touch on that because baby girl you ain't hiding you ain't going nowhere don't forget where you came from don't forget the things that you have done to an innocent man and actually you was the cyber bullying it's it's crazy how you continue to eat off of the things that you have done to people and you making it seem like it's done happen to you and how you take in bits and pieces of other people's story you're sick you're a true definition of a thin line between love and hate type bitch Okay, that's you. That's you, Lyona. And point blank, period. Whoever don't like what I'm saying, oh, wow. Because go through my videos. Y'all will see what type of devil this girl is. And look at what you're wearing. You can see your pussy print, all of that. I've, I've, I'm starting to believe that you done bought one of them panties to give you a little pouch down there. And no homo. But is this how a wife... With a, a boyfriend on the side, supposed to be dressing. Like, don't you got enough niggas already? Don't you? You got a a, white, a husband and you got a, a boyfriend. So why you need to even wear this fit? First of all, that's a couple of sizes too small for you. A couple of sizes too small for you, baby girl. But let's get to it. For all the women's. When I say all the women's, I'm talking about all the women's. Okay, you know she mean all the Tatianas, all the Jezebels, all the all the all the Reds, all the all the Sukianas, all the all of the all of those the Jezebels and stuff like that. So that's who she's talking about because no woman in their right mind, and even if I wear something like that, it's gonna be an appropriate size. <laughs> and I'm pretty sure she be wearing that around her sons and her kids. Look at the pouch and shit though, like. You don't think her her sons and should be staring? It's just certain things that you should do as a woman and carry yourself. And right now, 
girl, you on a you on one. You on one. <laughs> like a good comfy legging set to take your butt outside and run them errands. Or if you just want to be in the house and be fine with your man, you know what I'm saying? Then <laughs> This commentary is funny, but um, if you just want to be fine, you know, so the leggings come above, you know, they high waisted, okay. For all my girls who like a control, tummy, okay. And the leggings set also is giving, you know, insinuates whatever you got, you know what I'm saying, whatever you got. <laughs> Girl, and that's definitely not what God, your mama, or your daddy gave you. <laughs> that's what the doctor and DR gave you. Shake with who got. Shake with who got. Stop fooling people because trust and believe. Oh, the video is going to be right after this. Trust and believe women with natural bodies is not going to look right in these materials that she's starting to sell, that she's trying to sell. Her dollar store tree materials. But let's go. These are so comfortable. Okay, these are so comfortable. I would throw me on probably a gray puffer vest or, I don't know, it's giving, uh, nah, I could with some white forces. Come on, probably wearing that shit around her father, knowing that her father's a molester, knowing that her father done touch kids, her father probably looking at her, dreaming about, huh, let me not even start nothing, but hint, 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 hint. Girl, hint, hint, you're a mother of three now. Hint, hint, no, you're a mother of four, actually. You're a mother of four now. Hint, hint, you should change the way you uh you dress. Hint, hint, you got a, ch a child molester under your roof. Hint, hint. Okay, but anyways. Uh, some ankle boots, some Uggs. Oh, some Uggs, you know, girls love the Uggs. Girls love the Uggs. Y'all know y'all love the Uggs. But it's giving comfortable. It's giving, oh, I'm about to run to my man house. It's giving, oh, it's a quick little outfit I can throw on and then go be my, go see my man be like. <laughs> Ladies, y'all know y'all like being sexy and you know you like being comfortable. So I say get this outfit because it's something quick to just throw on and go outside and have fun. Or run your errands or go to the gym. I don't know if you want to go to the gym in this though. Because, you know, <laughs> it's giving a little, little body yaddy yaddy in this outfit. But, just saying. This outfit is super comfortable. It's real stretchy. Size is small to 3X. And this is her line. This is her clothing line. Look how it look on the big girl now. You see right here? Look how that look. Didn't I tell y'all? But look how I look on a fake body. Natural, fake body. Like, that's crazy. You out here scamming people again. That shit look horrible. Not the designs, the material. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. Look at the material. That's sad. See, I told you, it looked like she got a cup like her. <laughs> that shit look horrible on natural bodies. But you guys, y'all give me y'all thoughts and y'all opinion. Y'all tell me if I'm hating or I'm digging too deep. The same way she digs and she hates all the time. But yes, that video was now over. You guys give me y'all thoughts, y'all opinions. I'm definitely going to respond um, and engage back in the comments, or you could also pull up on my Instagram or my inbox under Shay's Reactions. And this is also my Cash App right here, Shay's Reactions One. Anything is definitely appreciated. I'm not picky by far. You could show love by pulling up and engaging in the comments, by like, sharing, and subscribing, by hitting that bell. Um, but yeah, you guys tell me what y'all think. Tell me if I'm digging too much. But yeah, Shay is definitely back. I'm definitely back. Um, and thank you for all my supporters that's patiently been waiting. Thank you for the behind the scenes cash app, even though I haven't been on and the messages on Instagram checking up on me. Yes, I see you guys. I definitely responded back to the ones that also checked on me and I'm definitely grateful. I'm definitely grateful. But even though it's been a little minute, just a little incy minute, 
I definitely had to come and show love because I definitely had to spread this awareness because this girl doesn't think people done forgot. She doesn't think she done changed and took all of that negative things down off her page. No, don't forget that you still hurt an innocent person that did nothing but try to love you and care for your children. And on top of not just getting a regular divorce, you tried to bash him and 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 steal his kids from him, steal his platform from him, do all of these things for somebody who still was trying to heal from cancer and that loved you in the process and that healed you and bigged you up and now look at what you got to do in return. But trust and believe, I'll be back with another video because I definitely got a couple in the trigger. But I'm out till next video.